the latest dual language program pilot project has gained much attention among parents, pupils, students and the teaching community. In an interview with Education Director General Datuk Sri Dr. Kari Muhammad Yusof on Friday, the Ministry revealed its plans for the project which gives school the option to adopt lessons such as science, mathematics and information technology in English or Bahasa Malaysia in a bid to uphold Malay while strengthening the usage of English. The concern about the level of uh, language proficiency has been discussed and deliberated in many platforms. Right? And the, the most important one is in, in the Malaysian Economic Council meeting. They have several meetings of that until at one time they just invite Ministry of Education as in the concerns, not from, from the, the, the members, but people from the industries, people from the businesses. There's something to be done more than what we have at the moment. Right? So we take note of those uh, <laughs> uh, input from the meetings and then we engage Pemandu and we discuss. And there is a need to increase the, uh, the hours of exposure in the languages. Right? One, we have the HIPS program, that's fine. But more ha need to be done in the classroom itself. Right? So they look at to increase the exposure of the language at the same time, we want to strengthen another language and another subject. They also talk about the science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. Right? So, during the lab, we discussed that this is the place that we need to both increase the level of uh, exposure in the language, at the same time strengthening and enriching this uh, science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. So that's why we come up with the, if possible, those subjects can be taught in both languages. This is a dual language program, see? so if they they cannot fulfill those criteria, right? You say they have to be conducted in dual language. The teachers have to teach in dual language, and the the support from the school head teachers and also the parents. Then they they, they have the choice. They have the option not to choose the LP. But if they want to, if the schools are ready. The parents, if they send their children there, then they have to follow the dual language program. So what happens is we have a, in a class, suppose in the year six or year one, you may have six classes. You may have a varying degree of the DLP. Maybe in one class, it's almost 100% in English. The other class may be a lesser amount of in English. So it will be conducted in dual language. So you mean that within one classroom, it might be taught in both BM and English? Yeah. If, say, uh, when the systems got very stable in the school, right? There may be one class that can conduct the whole subjects teaching and learning in English. Right? That may happen. Datuk Kai Muhammad Yusof says the ministry welcome any schools to join the pilot project, even if they are not part of the 300 schools chosen for it. This uh, dual language program is referred to dual languages under the policy of MBM MBI. So Basel English, Basel Mayu and Basel Inggris. That's why we choose here for a start for in the national schools and uh, secondary national schools. For the SJK, at the moment we are we are doing a lot of uh, intervention programs to support them. Right? We want to make sure that their mastery of the Basel Malaysia will be on par with the national schools. If you look at the UPSR 2014, right, uh, SK is more than 95% managed to reach the mastery level of the language, whereas the S of BM is it? BM, yeah. Whereas the SJK is about 75%. So we need to close that first. So we, our focus now is to give support them in their Basa Malaysia Basa Melayu, and when that is ready, then if they come with their expression of interest. They said the resources are ready, the, uh, the teachers are ready, the parents are ready, then we can consider for them for this program. It won't take long, I know they can do it very fast. Dr. Kai says another latest initiative by the government called the High Immersive Program helps strengthen English usage by increasing usage hours outside the classroom as well as increasing the students' confidence.